Ali here, and welcome back to Multicenter YouTube channel. Today, I've got something special for you. A no-nonsense guide on how to quickly create a killer website for free in 2024, with a special focus on creating a CV website as an example. But before we dive in, I want to give you a heads up. This video is all about efficiency. We're not going to spend hours tweaking designs or delving into super technical features. Instead, I'm going to show you the quickest and easiest ways to get your website up and running. First, let's find a hosting service. Search for Pro Freehost and click on the first link. Click on Register now and solve the CAPTCHA. Now, you are in the main dashboard. You need to activate your account, so click on Create New Account. After that, type the name of your website and select a free domain. I'm choosing this one. Check if it's available and if it is, Click here and solve another CAPTCHA. Now, click on Manage. Sometimes you need to wait and refresh the page. Then, click on Control Panel and approve the message. We now have a host. Next, let's install WordPress. Search for Soft Aculus App Installer first. And click on Install. Here is some information about the installation. Don't change anything, just keep the admin username and password with you. Then click Install and stay on the same page. Here is your website link and the WordPress dashboard link. Let's see the WordPress dashboard. Here is your WordPress dashboard. Let's check how our website looks like right now. We are going to change all of this, so don't worry. Okay. Now let's clean the website. Go to Pages and then All Pages. Now let's delete the existing pages. Click on Move to Trash and then click Apply. Now go to Trash and delete all the pages. Now let's go to Plugins and delete all the plugins in the same way. Now let's go to Themes and add a new theme. I have a theme for you guys. It's called Astra. It's the most used theme. And it's good for small businesses and personal websites. Let's install it and then activate it. Don't forget to install the Starter Template plugin. I will show you how to install a new plugin. Click on Add New, search for Elementor, and install it. Then activate it. Now, let's go to Pages and add new pages. Let's add a new page called Home and publish it. Now, let's edit this home page. 
go to Edit with Elementor. It's much easier. Now, we are on the Elementor interface. Let's design the website. Here, you can add a new section to start the website from scratch. You can add images by dragging and dropping. Or by selecting a file from the media library. You can add text, buttons, videos, or anything you want. Over here, you can change the content, the text, and add links or other settings. Here, you can also change the style, the color, and the font. Let's see some other advanced settings. There are a lot, but one important one is the motion effect. There are some amazing effects you can use. Now, let's see another method on how to make a website, not from scratch. Use the Starter Templates feature where you can easily import templates to your website. Let's choose this one, for example, this page. And then click Import Template. Now you can see that it's successfully imported to our website and you can adjust everything. Nobody is going to know that it's not your design. Okay, now let's import templates from outside WordPress. Go to Tyler Template. Here are some interesting templates. Let's search for entire page. Okay, this CV template might be interesting for university students like me. Let's test it. It looks good, clean, and clear with all the information needed. Now let's download it. So you are going to go back to your website in the Elementor editor. Click on Import and select the file you downloaded. Click Import and it's successfully imported. Now click Insert. Now it's successfully inserted into our website and you can easily adjust everything and add your own information. You can make it your professional CV website with all your information. Feel free to adjust and play with the settings as you want, okay? Let's go back, click Apply, and let's see the website. The website doesn't show the page huh? we created, let's fix it. Go to Settings, Reading, and change the home page setting. Go to Static Page and select Our Page, the Home Page. Save changes. Okay, now we are good. The website is fully functional. Now, let's customize the header. There are a lot of settings over here. I'm not going to go through all of them, but you can play with the colors and other settings.
Now let's go to the header builder or just click on the title. Now you can easily delete the title if you want and add a logo. Let's upload a logo. You can crop it to adjust the size and make it look good. We are not going to use it, I'm just showing how it works. If you have many pages, you can create a menu. It's pretty easy, but we are not going to waste time on it. You can search over here and it's all easy to work with. Now, let's delete the header. We want the website to look clean and clear for you. Okay, this is the final result. I hope you liked the video. See you in the next tutorial.